What is going on, friends? Welcome into twitch.tv slash Mercado Airwaves Network here on Super Mercado Bros as we do our Let's Play of Resident Evil 3 Remake. <laughs> Thank you guys so much. I'm your host, Mike Mercado. I'm so excited to get this going. I Everybody knows if you're joining us for the first time, anybody who's been a part of Super Mercado Bros or anything that has to do with Mercado Airways knows that when it comes to video games, Resident Evil and Zelda are our two favorite franchises. And sometimes each day it changes on which is number one. But I absolutely adored Resident Evil 2 Remake last year. I thought it was the game of the year. Resident Evil 4 is probably my favorite game of all time. So it, it makes an argument of why it would be the top of my franchise list. List. And now we get to play Resident Evil 3. This is the one that I have not gotten a chance to play on the main titles. And for anybody who's new to the Resident Evil franchise, Resident Evil 3 was in development at the same time as Code Veronica. And Code Veronica was supposed to be Resident Evil 3. But because of the sex, the sex of, of Resident Evil 2, they made... Resident Evil 3, they streamlined it. Resident Evil Nemesis, and that became Resident Evil 3. So, this is a, a shorter game. It has Joe Valentine in it, and Carlos Oliveira, so it's going to be very fun to see uh, how this plays out. I'm super excited to, to get it going, and let's go ahead and start our Let's Play of Resident Evil 3. And for any of you who are new to the channel, Go to youtube.com slash Mercado Airwaves Network and you can see our full playthrough of Doom Eternal. We just finished that up. That was a lot of fun. This pandemic has spread faster than any disease in modern history. Best intro ever in a Resident Evil game. Already, hands down. Holy crap, that was amazing. What a great opening. There he is. Yeah, let's go. Love this. Get us right into the game. I know it's a short one, but I'm a Resident Evil mark. I don't care. I love all of this. And make sure you guys are following me on social media if you want to see what we're up to on the network, what we're playing next, what podcast we got coming next. I'm on Twitter at Mike and Media on Instagram at Mike Mercado Media. And you guys can like the network on Facebook at Mercado Airwaves. And make sure you guys do us a huge favor. Wherever you get your favorite podcast, check us out at RE8. What, uh, what is that going to be like? After Resident Evil 7, we obviously were in first person with the Louisiana feel to it. Super creepy. I love it. So obviously we know this is going to be in third person. We played the demo, which you could watch us in our Let's Play of our, the Resident Evil 3 demo. Oh, this is cool. She's gone completely conspiracy nut. Is there anybody we know? Was she... So as far as I know, too, about the canon and the story, this takes place during Resident Evil 2. So, 
And apparently, after you play through this, and if you go back to Resident Evil 2... Oh, I love that this game was totally built for headphones. I'm so glad I got these new bad boys. But what do you guys think? Let me know and leave a comment below or on social media. Where do you guys think? What kind of perspective will Resident Evil 8 be? Since we do know that there will be a Resident Evil 4 remake. Ready? Here comes uh, the famous picture everybody's seen. The gun's right there. No, she's turning to a zombie. Damn. Hell yeah. Is that supposed to be Chris right there? September. Dude, hell yeah, it's still in first person, too. I love this. Pills. Escape Raccoon City. Worst month in my life. So can you read out the TV? No. And this is supposed to take place in the 90s if it's during Resident Evil 2, right? What do we got here? Joe's report. September 26, 1998. It's already been two months since the mess with Umbrella. Thanks to the suspicion, investigations haven't progressed exactly as I'd hoped. Perhaps this written record of what I found be communicable via several different avenues outlined below. By from an infected individual following the mixing of bodily fluids, contact with crows which have eaten infected carrion. Due to the strength of the virus, airborne infection can be dis what's that? discounted. It should be noted that those who survived the incident have not yet developed symptoms. It's unclear whether this is because the virus has become long, has a long incubation period, or because we just happen to be resistant to the infection. We ought to remain vigilant, even after this investigation period ends. As for me, aside from my minor difficulty sleeping, I seem to be in fine shape. Still, I shouldn't get too hopeful. After all, this could be an extended incubation. Fascinating. And then that's all of them from from uh, Resident Evil 1. Investigation notes. Pharmaceuticals company, industry leader in market share, focuses on military weapons development while maintaining cover as a pharmaceutical company. Also secretly developing bioweapons. T-virus outbreak at Arkley Mountains Research Facility predi predicated the mansion incident. Conspiring with Raccoon City leadership, large donation to Mayor Warren's office. What's this? Let's do the envelope. They've got me pinned down at home. Guys across the street are watching me from their window 24-7. Are they Irons Men umbrellas? I don't know. And there's really no real difference anyway. I know what they're trying to do. They want me to wear me down, torment me into compliance, and it's working. I'm barely eating, barely sleeping. I'm going crazy. I feel like I'm like the living dead. I won't let them win. I have to get out of the city and find a way to make them accountable. They'll send me home to silence, of course. You hear that I've been killed or whatever. It is they do to people like me. You must pick up the investigation where I left off and close my files. They'll tell you everything you need to know as long as the package isn't intercepted. I'll be moving out at night five days. Wish me luck. 
Wonder who's that from? A lot of creaking, a lot of noise. Who's this from? Message from a colleague. Hey, hot shot. How are you holding up? I still can't believe Iron suspended you. It's such bullshit. He ought to pin a medal on you for making it out of that hellhole back in July. Of course, you're going to poke around and ask questions about it. I hope you're not mad at me for keeping my head down. Everything's been happening so fast. Stars was a pride of the force. When the chief disbanded us out of nowhere, I, I thought for sure I was going to lose my job. Word has it you're planning to leave Raccoon City. I figured you wouldn't take the suspension line down. Just promise to watch your back. Umbrella won't sit by while you dismantle their business. Take care, Joe. Brad Vickers, Stars Alpha Team, now and forever. P.S. Had to slip this message to the pizza guy to avoid detection. Enjoy the extra large meat, mega meat supreme. It's on me and the guys. Ah. Uh, beer. Bakery bread. More beer, some soda. Jill likes to party. J Jill likes to party. Oh shit. Jump scare. Oh no. Well, maybe it's still coming. go September 28th 8:07 p.m. Raccoon City and now we're in third person damn they're both so good though I don't know which one I like more It's like that right away? Damn. Damn, a chasing to start the game. <laughs> Damn, poor Jill, they put her through the ringer already. <laughs> why why are you saying things so early, Jill? Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh, 
<laughs> 10 out of 10! 10. 10 out of 10! Holy... Yeah. Oh no. Objective, get out of town. Yeah. Problem on Twitch. But we are back. We got ourselves uh, some more room. That's good. Is there anything we want from in here that we can use? No, we need that for sure. Let's put that for right now in case. See, we need a simple lock. Ooh. What is going on here? What the hell is going on out there? Thank you. All right, so. I got to figure out how to open up the inventory without it going straight to maybe it's like that for everything. I don't know. I'll look it up online later. Okay. Clear that part. Let's go. Yeah. Master of locks. The key to the high voltage area has gone missing. The earliest will be able to get a replacement in this next week. In the interim, a lockpick will be provided to the senior employee on duty. We only have one lockpick and cannot afford to lose it, so keep it in its carrying case at all times when you're using it. And please, could you all check just once more that you did not actually take the key home? If you happen to find it, please bring it to Canon Admin. What is that shit? You think he's alive? Oh, that was gross. Oh man. Can I combine it with anything? No. I know you could double combine them, but whatever. And uh, is that the uh, lock pick? Yeah. That's cool. Oh, I can't combine them with those anymore? Alright, so I'll leave those right there. Oh, wait. There you go. There we go. We did it, guys. Alright, so we cleared this area. You want to try to open this right now? She's the master of locks. Oh no! Oh, is this the first bad guy? Oh no! Oh no! Ugh. Oh no, what happened?
Oh, shoot. Joe got messed up. Oh. Oh, you could uh, get rid of it yourself. That's kind of interesting. That's messed up, G. Alright, let's we'll finish up this one and then we'll call it a session, my friends. Go, 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 Joe. Come on. There we go. We got two more. Go to this one. We got one more. It's over there. Come on, Jill. Go, 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 go. Oh, no. No. That is so abrasive and very disturbing. I don't like any of it. I don't like the symbolization. Super creepy. What's my mission now? Uh, use the control panel to restore power. Okay. Thank you guys so much for joining us. Oh man. I have no idea where I'm going. Oh no. Oh no. Oh man. Woo! Oh, man. I hate that. I mean, I'll just say it, that rapey feel to it. Hell yeah. That green herb helps forever. Get me the hell out of here, dude. That was 
was unreal. Yeah. Ugh. All right, so really fast. No, I don't have anything. Let's see how it looks in there now. Let's try to get that uh, those bullets really fast. It's straight ahead. And take a left. Let's see if this clears the room. Yes, all right, we cleared the room. Uh, my compulsions, my OCD is A-OK -okay now. Or at least satisfied. Oh, let's go. All right, guys, I think this is a nice place to go ahead and save it. Thank you guys so much for joining us here on twitch.tv slash Mercado Airwaves Network. Let's play of Super Mercado Bros. Let's play of Resident Evil 3. I appreciate you guys joining us so much. I'm your host, Mike Mercado. We'll see you next time right here. Make sure you guys are following me on Twitter at Mike and Media and on Instagram at Mike Mercado Media. We love you guys. We'll see you here next time.